A zero emissions car only Aquaman could love, Porsche backs off the hybrid tip, and Michael Schumacher's taxi joyride may have put him on cops' radar. Hey everybody, I'm Derek D. Detroit, and you're watching a fast lane that happens to be daily. If there's a weird concept to go after, the boys from Rin Speed are all over it. Remember their splash concept? Now they've taken it a step further. Or is that a fathom? It's the company's new scuba concept. This fully electric model is rear wheel drive on land. But on water, it's two jet drive motors give it the thrust for underwater adventures. Rinspee says the scuba can dive down to 33 feet underwater. Of course, they also come with a self-contained breathing apparatus for driver and passenger while rear-mounted propellers give the Scuba Zero Emissions cruisability. We'll get the first look at the concept at the Geneva Motor Show in early 2008. German media reports Porsche may be reconsidering its plan for hybrids. The sports car maker says a new hybrid Cayenne SUV is on track for 2010, but plans for a hybrid version of its new Panamera executive car are reportedly being dialed back. Company bosses say the market for hybrids in the U.S. will stall out at 5%, making a widespread rollout as likely as a 911 Turbo powered by dark beer and veal sausages. And remember how Michael Schumacher recently commandeered a taxi to get to the airport in record time? Turns out German police may be thinking that wasn't such a stellar idea. German newspaper Bild reports cops are investigating to determine whether or not Schumacher broke the law. Apparently in Germany, not just anyone can drive a taxi, even a seven-time world champion Formula One driver. Next up, a new Mini gets a new name, and Europe gets another hot hatch while we're left in the cold. That's in a little thing we like to call the internet rumor mill, right after this. It's Fast Lane Daily from the Detroit Auto Show. Fast Lane Daily from the Detroit Auto Show. Can't get enough awesome car video? Want more than just FLD, VOD cars, and Garage 419? Check out our friends over at streetfire.net. Just don't try that stuff at home. No, seriously, don't try that stuff at home. You picked it, we report it fresh from the Fastlane Daily feed. Unless you've been holed up in an ice fishing shack writing your anti-government manifesto, you know Mini's new SUV is on the way. Now, word is, it'll be called the Crossman. That's like a Clubman on which the more rugged Mini will be based, only it'll be more of a crossover model. Insiders also say all the new Mini models will start with the letter C. No word on the new Mini Confederate, which may or may not have a pickup bed. And finally, score another hot hatch for Europe. While we're stuck with a Ford Focus designed during the Carter administration, where it is the new Focus RS will soon hit the old world. Ford reps say a new rally-inspired, high-performance Focus will be the next project from Ford Europe. No word yet on technical details, but we hear the Focus RS will launch sometime in 2009. Well, that wraps up the coolest show in the world for today. Tune in tomorrow when we build a submarine out of a 1978 Ford LTD, and by build, we mean forget to set the parking brake. Yep. Ha, 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 ha.